don't know if, what's happening. Uh, notice I've been under a lot of shorts up lately. Um, I've just been ever so busy, ever so fucking busy, and uh, trying to keep in contact with everything comes on. You know it's like. Also, my son's doing very well. He's sort of passing over now. At a very young age, he's 18. This is very hard. He's been with four years, got homeschooling. He's doing really well. So I'm going to put a bit of work on his video today, and you can um, have a little look. As you know, I've been protecting him a little bit from all keyboard warriors out there and the lefties. Right. So on this job, I'm going to put a few little clips up. The main part of this job today was I'm doing two. Uh, Decorative piers on here now. Decorative piers ain't structural, they're completely aesthetic. Now, what it was on this internal skin, you can see, and none of it's seen because this is a bar area. You've got walls coming out, two and a half brick walls coming out, it's probably um, the bar top. Now, the other side, the nine inch Flemish steps into four inch because we was going to put some uh, oak through, die egg. Um, but just to break the space up, I thought, you know what, I put a couple of decorative piers in, you know, so I filmed it on here. So, um, to show you. Um, I'll clean them, do what I can because we haven't got the uh, squints here. So I'll hand cut them. And what I'll do is I'll get them in. When it's all gone off, I'll rub them down. Or Sammy will rub them down on uh, Monday or Tuesday. So, yeah, that's where we are today. I'll probably put a few little bits up of the progress of this. Um, what we're doing. Very interesting one. This is for the red line in Ingate Stone. It's part of the heritage. It's a listed building that goes back to, they reckon, 1700. The first, they start, started to sell brewer, beer, brewery, you know, and then eventually they added on and started to sell actual pints, become a guest house. So it's a lovely place inside. I'll show you some videos in there. But, um, gentlemen, sit back and have a little watch, and uh, thanks for the support.
good. So what's happening here is, is we've got a piers inside to take the worktop, but this Panama felt was a bit open. So as an added on detail, we thought we'd put these Roman piers in. Now you can see I'm false jointing it, which I've done already. Um, so you're putting two halves in because it's so fully over one brick. Now I'm gonna put nails into the, uh, the bed joint. Now it's bad practice, should do, but at least it gives you some sort of fixing. We ain't got time to go and get a fur fix now. The reason being, it's decorative. It's just aesthetically. We strips in here in the backboard, which I'll show you in a moment. But when the worktop comes over 100 mil, it's just decorative in between the panels. So that will give it some sort of hold. Not actually doing anything structurally. for the bottom I'm nagging reverse it because she's now gonna come out so instead of going 30 mil from the top I need to take it from the bottom so what we do is you go 30 mil up 30 mil in
you in this car. Now, because I've pulled a bomb, this joint here, so you get a nice minimum third of the brick, sorry, maximum third of the brick should be called in to a shield tip. So what I'm doing there is, what I'll open up with a bomb is burnt up. Good. Nice decade. 